polar bear's back end out there. Oh, oh my, oh my god. Jerry? Hey there, Jesse. Long time no see, eh? Yeah, <laughs> like, it, it really has been a long time, man. I, I can't believe it. I mean, the last time I saw you, you had a baby face. But now, look at you. You got a full-out beard, dude. And here I am, and all I can grow is a fucking chin strap. Uh, are you okay there, bud? Yeah, I, 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 I'm I, fine, you know? It's just, I've always had a dream of growing a majestic beard, but I can't, because a little thing I like to call genetics. I mean, seriously, how is it that I can grow hair everywhere else? And I mean everywhere else. I, I shit you not, but I can't grow a proper beard. That doesn't make any sense. Where's the, where is the logic in that? Oh, it ain't in there, Jesse. I'm sure you'll be able to grow a beard one day. Thanks, I guess. How'd you get here anyway? I called an Uber Moose. Did you say an Uber Moose? I, <laughs> I, I didn't even know that was a thing. It most certainly is. Interesting. Uh, uh, I'll keep that in mind. What the hell? Holy sweet fuckery! Oh, uh, yeah. I might have forgot a little detail there, eh? I, I, I have a pet beaver named Theodore. That, that thing, that thing in your bag, that buck tooth killing machine, that thing is your pet? Yep. You know what, I actually take it back. I'm, I'm not gonna lie, I'm actually pretty jealous of you that you have a pet beaver because the only pets that I got are a cat, a dog, a Vaporeon, a Sylveon, an Eevee, two talking teddy bears, a talking spider, and a talking owl. Oh, it sounds like a lot of pets to me. Now, if you'll excuse me, I'm feeling a little parched. So, Jerry, what brings you? Oh. Ooh, that is so refreshing, eh? Ooh. Sorry about that, Jesse. Go on. Got any particular reason for coming here? Well, a polar bear peed on my igloo and the thing melted faster than cheese curds on poutine. So I had no choice but to find a new place to stay. Why couldn't you just build a new igloo? I figured it was time to move on from that igloo life. So I came to Ontario in hopes that you would let me live in your place. Um, gee, I, I, I don't know, Jerry. It's pretty crowded here as is. Oh, uh, I see. W well then, I guess I'll take myself, my maple syrup, and my beaver elsewhere. Huh. Jerry, wait. Uh, you can live here, all right? But on one condition. You're going to have to figure out living arrangements for Theodore because I'll be damned if I have to clean up after owl shit, cat shit, and beaver shit on top of that, okay? So deal with it or else you and your beaver are out of here. Oh, oh, thank you so much, Jesse. You're a really good guy. Yeah, I'm fucking wonderful. Oh, I can't wait to tell everyone that I live here now. I am so excited, let me tell you. Good God, what did I just agree to? <laughs> Yeah, 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 yeah.